What's up guys, my name is Zello Coolplay, and in today's video we're going to be talking about Tom Clancy's Division, especially regarding dedicated servers, proximity chat, DLC, free content, and more. But with that out the way, let's jump right into it. So we have a recent interview with Magnus Jensen of VG247 who gave us some great information regarding dedicated servers on Tom Clancy's The Division. So the game will have dedicated servers to guarantee a smooth steady experience for all those players who are coming in from playing Destiny and wanting a new game. And also on another note, in the Dark Zone there's going to be a maximum of 24 players and that's our player count for PvP in Tom Clancy's The Division. So it looks like it's not going to be too crowded in the game but rest assured you're going to run into some AI along the way when you're traveling on your journey to become a rogue agent if that's what you want to become. Also, in other news, the game will fully support proximity chat, which to me is the absolute most exciting thing about this game, because I can just picture all the trolling that's going to happen as soon as, you know, this game comes out. Just picture surrendering to somebody only to shoot them in the back. This game's going to be wild. Now, moving on to single player. What single player is basically going to do is that, you know, they're going to scale the difficulty based upon your group size. It's not going to be like everyone's a one-man nuke when you, when you put it on hard, because the difficulty is going to be set for you. They really wanted this game to be a somewhat solo game, but found that this game is best played with multiple people. Now, when roaming the open world, you'll find that it, it's somewhat like Fallout in that the AI is segmented in rank. Also, what's cool is that once you reach level 30, the Dark Zone is going to reset and offer only level 30 enemies, giving you much more of a challenge. And of course, level 30 is going to be your maximum rank for both your single player rank and your Dark Zone rank. And if you didn't know, there are two ranks in this game, the Dark Zone rank and the single player rank. The Dark Zone rank fluctuates depending on your performance in PvP, which is another thing that's going to be very interesting to see how that plays out in this game. And also, once you hit level 30, there will be new gear associated to that level as well. Now there's going to be over 10 main missions throughout the game, and these are going to be more of your long-winded, linear experiences with key boss battles and plot points throughout the game. Now, this is going to come with two difficulties, normal and hard mode. And hard mode is going to offer bigger payouts and XP and loot. But what's cool about the loot is that things like scopes can be interchanged between anything from sniper rifles, assault rifles, submachine guns, etc. But, of course, there will be specific attachments for certain kinds of weapons. Also, there's going to be something called landmarks in the game. And these landmarks are going to offer tough enemies in exchange for some really good loot. And these, I feel, are going to become very familiar farming places for legendary items and weapons throughout the game. Magnus Jensen also goes on to say that there will be no microtransactions in this game. So basically, you're not going to be able to fast track to the top and get the best and greatest vanity items and gear. You're going to have to work for it. And hopefully, this keeps people involved in the game for a longer time. Also, Magnus said there's going to be DLC and there's going to be free content sprinkled in between the DLC. So hopefully, this also keeps people involved in the game. Also, last but not least, if you guys were wondering whether or not you'd have trouble streaming The Division, mo making videos about it, or even posting screenshots, you won't have a problem with that. There are no rules against doing that whatsoever. Alright guys, this concludes our video for today. If you liked my video, please leave a like and subscribe. For all the latest and the greatest news on Tom Clancy's The Division, keep it locked to my channel. My name is Hello Cool Play, and I'm out.